Good morning. This is the day after the big hunt at Wilderness Lodge. Eddie and I, for the first time ever, did a video yesterday afternoon. Uh, we came into a, a white oak flat, put up two stands, uh, as best as we could tell, properly for a cameraman and a hunter. And we're in the stand only about 30 minutes when we had the perfect size, about a 90 pound fallow doe walk, doe, doe walk up. At that point, Eddie was blocked by his uh, view of the camera and, and I was trying to get his attention. Well, we have very short footage of the doe actually coming out and me shooting it at 30 yards. Uh, but we're gonna slow-mo it down to where you can actually see the shot of the arrow uh, and it worked out perfect. We come up here yearly to Wilderness Lodge. We're big deer hunters normally, but we use this place as a treat for us. Uh, also keeps us tuned for the, for the whitetail season. Come up in the spring and turkey and meat hog hunt and uh, in the fall to shoot fallow does and at times I have shot a fallow buck here that was a trophy. Um, but just a great place, beautiful weather, the leaves were peaking and we had a great time so we hope you enjoy the video. Yesterday morning we both, both Chip and I shot two fallow does, it was awesome and um, I was only planning on coming and shooting one so we decided to try to video and I'd, I'd never been with Chip in a tree so we took my ladder stand, relocated it moved it in a little better location and then got chip situated right above me it was awesome but it happened so fast we were in the tree for less than 30 minutes and i was blocked by the view and i didn't even see the doe coming and uh, till i barely got the camera on it and uh, chip busted the crap out of it it was an awesome shot you're gonna have a great time watching it next year we'll be back Where are we going? We're in we're at Wilderness Lodge in Monterey, Tennessee. Getting ready to go on a fallow doe bow hunt. It's the first one we've ever videoed, but stand by, we have a lot of experience. Alright, we're killing our scent by stepping in the shed. Did you see that 30 yard shot? <laughs> Did you see the red spot? This was the fastest the hunt I've ever been on. We didn't even have time hardly to film it. What just took place? We had about a 90 pound fallow doe walk up. We'd only been in the tree like 30 minutes and she was going by at 30 yards and a mouth bleated and stopped her and shot her and you saw the red spot appear behind her shoulder immediately. You could hear the arrow hit on the video. We just missed out on some pre-footage, but it, it all worked out great. We're getting ready to go look for it. Yeah, I was trying to film it, and I couldn't see because of some uh, leaves and limbs in front of me, and so I couldn't get I couldn't get a shot of it walking up. But it walked about 50 yards straight through some clear stuff for Chip, and then it popped out. I barely got it on film. He busted the crap out of it. We're gonna go hunt it down now. I think it's dead. Way to go.
great shot. There he is, about 50 yards yeah, from us right now. Running. He's I only ran 50 yards. He's down. There's where we were set up, about 30, a little over 30 yards from here. Chip made an awesome shot. That is beautiful. Can you hear me? Yeah. I nicknamed my new bow, PSE Bow Madness, Robin Heart Shot Hood. I've already shot three white tails with it, all heart shots. This was a perfect heart shot. It was there was just a runway of blood leading right to it. Muzzy MX4 broadhead. <laughs>